<laughs> this light. Mess with the light nearest to me. And to summon them somehow. Oh, don't worry, I got tricks for this. Hello and welcome back to Spirits with Spirits. Today we are in Rowena, Pennsylvania. Rowena. Specifically, we are at the Hans Graf Cemetery in Rowena, Pennsylvania. Joe, do you want a little background history of Hans Graf? I know there's a werewolf. There's a werewolf. Yeah, so today we're not just hunting ghosts, we are hunting a werewolf ghost. Gert. Werewolf ghost. Gert. I'm not gonna say that. Actually, it's a whole family. Long story short, Hans Graf, Dude was the original settler here in, I wanna say 1711 from Switzerland. Dude got married twice, had 11 kids, died in, I wanna say, doesn't matter, he died. So, he died um, a while ago. Which ironically, he is actually buried a half hour from here, but this is named after him and this entire place is full of his descendants. Um, little folklore with him though is locals actually thought that he was a werewolf during his lifetime, now, there what was no made, like, pillage or anything. What made the locals feel like he was a werewolf? Like, probably a lot of fleas. Long story short, they all thought he was a werewolf. He died. And even though he's not buried here, they say that at this specific cemetery, which is full of his descendants, that several of them were also put on trial for allegedly also being werewolves, just per relation. It's like, whole pack, whole pack. Um, now these weren't people that just like, were like the circus werewolf people that had the no they didn't look know, like them they didn't like look they like literally them. just thought these people like fucking anamorphed and murked shit yeah okay that's pretty cool like tip so like real werewolves. werewolves real not, werewolves. not not the furry boys okay um i can get with that so activity that is known to happen here there's there's a little twist on this one so you get the normal you get the growls you get the orbs people say canines literally just start appearing and like growling, like local dogs will just start going nuts too. Um, and people visually have seen a white wolf or white hound, not Bucky Barnes, like a literal white four-legged wolf and a white giant bipedal werewolf. Has bipedal. Uh, yeah, people have claimed to be chased off of this property by a werewolf. Ghost of a werewolf. Come at me. Now, plot twist, there's a curse. There's a curse. So. Of course, yeah. Every full moon, if you circle this property seven times, by morning, you die. You die, so you literally it's a die. it's werewolf murder curse. So luckily we're here on the 23rd of July, 2021. Just happens to be. A full moon. A full moon. So Joe and I, we're gonna have what we're gonna call the death race. Not to be confused with that movie with the tombstone. Yeah, no, I'm not getting in Jason Statham's way. No one's getting in Jason Statham's way, dude. No. The Rock barely can get in his way. He just did it for a couple mil. Are they family? Oh, they're all family. All right. So during our research, we didn't see anything about us having to do the seven laps in the middle of the night or whatever for us to do this death race. It just says, circle the property during the evening of a full moon. You're gonna die by morning. Yeah. Sun is literally setting. We just wanna get the time to get everything set up with the infrared and all that. So we're gonna do we're gonna do our laps and we'll see if we die by morning. All we'll right. have to tune in on that. So if I die after this, that's cool. That's cool. Just... Um so do you wanna do outside? Because it's kinda of tricky to get over it over there, or do you wanna go? I think you inside? have to do outside though, don't you? Maybe. Yeah, we'll try it. Yeah. It's too humid for this. It's humid, yeah. Keep going, boys. That's why you're on the payroll, you're the best. Lap three. Our only employee, <laughs> we don't pay her. Nope. <laughs> Humid as fuck. So I don't, I feel a little dizzy. Yeah, I feel hot. Yeah. I am a hot boy. 
as far as everything goes, we did the seven laps and we're supposed to die now. Of heat stroke. So we'll just see how it goes. Tune in later for that one. Now we're gonna set up for tonight. We walked around this place seven times, so we're hoping to die tonight. Uh, not hoping to, but you know, if it happens, it happens, but that's the curse. And right now we're gonna do some mag light tests, and then what after the mag light? Probably get into some EVPs. EVP, spirit yeah. box, you know. Yeah. You boys are gonna do our standards. You want good cop or bad cop? Be bad cop. Turn it off if you're here. Turn it off you if you're You dumb bitch. Here. Yeah. I gotta be the bad guy. You're all right in my books. You're, you suck. You're a bad man. I love Swiss cheese. If you were a werewolf and you had that kind of power, if you could give that to me, that'd be cool. But if you could move one of these first, that'd be cooler. So. Which did, one just flickered? Did I see something? The last something one? just flickered. That one. I that one did. Know. I think it was that one. One of them flickered. If anyone's here, please just flicker either light and we'll go from there. Anyone's here, mess with the light. Light. Woo! Mess with the light nearest to me. And to summon them somehow. Oh, don't worry, I got tricks for this. Okay. So right now we're gonna do EVP session in the middle of the graveyard. Hopefully get some werewolves to come out. If not, we'll be werewolfless. I bet I can entice them, Joe. How? If there's a werewolf here, I'll share my super sweet toy I borrowed from my dog's rose and blue. Just, just squeak it a couple times. And let's, let's see what we get here. You can have it if you want, but you have to say something to us. It sounds like a dying animal. All right, so basically we got nothing here. It is what it is, it's disappointing. We drove two and a half hours away, but at the end of the day, you can't expect ghosts to be like, yeah, you're here, so I'll Yeah, I mean, it's not like you can make appointments. Yeah. Um, I am kind of sad, because this was probably my most anticipated one of the first season, if we're being honest here, because uh, there's so many people with um, interactions that have documented from this area, and it, such a wide variety of shit that's happened here. Like I was really thinking this is probably gonna be like the one. Yeah. Where we, if there was anything. But anything. We'll, we'll just have to see if we die before morning. Yeah, we still have to deal with that. Um, so if we do, if I do, I guess I'll just have to be wrong. Yep. I guess this whole time and I'll have to admit that ghosts are real. <laughs> I know fucking bugs are real. Oh my God. Bugs are real here. Um, yeah. Bugs are real. So, um, yeah, Hans Groff, it's a beautiful little spot. I don't know if I would do this distance to do it again. It was a dead spot. And I'm, yeah, that was. Dead spot. Dead spot. We got nothing. Yeah. Normally, if we get anything, we'll just keep going, but. Nothing here. Sorry, Hans. So, we'll see in the morning. We'll see if we die. We'll see in the morning. Yeah. We fuck. Fucking bugs next week on Spirits with Spirits. So we are in Clearfield County, Pennsylvania, and we are hunting no other than Bigfoot. 